So let's talk about trimming around the feet. So Sky's had a bath recently. He's got quite a lot of growth you can see his coat is on the floor around his feet and this is all getting dirty because it's touching the floor so it's time for this to be tidied up and it's the only trimming that we really do other than hygiene um you know it's the only trimming that if you want to keep your dog in full coat that you need to do i've done his pads his pads are nice and clear but i need to trim this excess fur from around here now the important thing for this is and i've put the noose on his neck that keeps your dog on the table stops and jumping off so if you've got a dog that i know he won't jump off but if you've got a dog that does jump off then you need to use the noose around the neck but the reason i've got it on here now is because i want to keep his head up so if i show you if i take it off if sky drops his head if he drops his head that's his head down it alters the length of the fur there see how it's come up so i want to make sure his head is up and in a good position before i start cutting this fur so keeping his head up will keep all this front fur in the right place so the first thing to do is to brush just move that a little bit that way is to brush our comb actually stand is to comb through this and make sure you can get the comb all the way through the feet through every single part of the paw stand and I'm going to hold his foot where I want it to be this is very long isn't it Sky I think we're a bit behind on doing this and the easiest way to do it is just to cut straight along put your scissors on the floor the table and just do a straight cut down there straight that way straight that way and straight down the inside now if you find that hard to do to see lift the opposite paw and do straight down there and by cutting it straight along and not going round there's no need to go round you get a nice level line there and then all you do straight across the front and keeping his paw lifted at the opposite side just to keep him still and then take your corners off and take that corner off stand and then check stand stand so again you brush brush down stand and just check and then do any tidying up if you want to tidy anything up there we go take that corner off across the front stand straight down the inside and there we go anything that's touching the floor stand anything that's touching the floor you see i've still got a little bit from underneath touching the floor there i'm just going to take that off And all of this doesn't come into it you just this is staying out of the way while the rest of it gets trimmed if i just brush that back down stand stand still sky you've been a fidget you've been a typical model dog hey how that just looks a lot neater now there it's not treading all over the floor so same on the back, just keep your lines nice and straight. So I'm just going to go straight along there, take that off. I'm lifting this out of the way, none of this body hair should be cut as part of the paw, so just move that out of the way 
I'm just cutting his foot that's it straight across the front Oops, sorry Sky and then just take the corners off and I'm going to go straight down the inside which I find easiest to do from this side lift that foot out of the way and go straight down the inside then the back I'm just going to take off anything that's touching the floor take the corners off and there we go stand good boy so I've not affected the length of his coat in any way I've just tidied up the fur that's been touching the floor round his feet that gets really really mucky and that's how you do the feet stand still stand good boy I'm just gonna go in and tidy that bit up okay so now we've got neat feet neat feet sky hey there we go hold well on